We all know DeepSeek's new upgraded V3 model is incredible. It's an open source model under the MIT license. Its performance across every benchmark makes it a great all-rounder, but its real edge is its coding capabilities. DeepSeek V3 truly shines in reasoning, front-end development, and smart tool use, and it's even ideal for non-complex reasoning tasks when you turn off DeepThink. This is why today I am back again to showcase a new coding tool that will let you harness the capability of this model, and that is with DeepSight. This is a development tool that you can easily access off of Hugging Face Spaces and what people have been capable of creating is insane. You can see the type of quality that it outputs with these different apps like you can see over here, transform your finances with this application that was fully developed with DeepSight, harnessing the capabilities of the DeepSeek model, which is insane. What's funny is that someone actually made an Elden Ring game. So you can see over here, you have this funny game that someone was capable of developing with this model and that is just kind of impressive to see that this model has the capability of generating various sorts of apps in different categories now i'll tell you one thing this is a great free alternative to many of the other tools that we've seen on this channel as well as on the main channel because it is something that doesn't have any rate limits which is something that the Gemini 2.5 Pro model has and in this case it does output the same sort of quality or similar quality as the Claude 3.7 Sonnet as well as the Gemini 2.5 Pro in terms of front end output. Now I know I said that this is a great front end development model but in this case you can also develop fully functional applications. In this case there's a 3D game editor that was developed and you can see all of the functionalities of these features are actually uh, working so in this case you can pan the camera you can orbit the camera as well as move objects so this is pretty cool to see that this is something that has multiple functional features now it's super simple to get started you can go over to this left hand panel where you can go and ask ai to do anything so you can say go ahead and create me a twitter clone and then you can go in and send in this prompt now you will be able to see a live visualization of what is being generated. On the left hand side you have the code being generated and then you'll be able to see the visualization of what was generated based off the code. And you can see right now all of the different uh, functionalities of Twitter is being generated in terms of like the buttons as well as the different fields and it is slowly but surely coding out everything. and just take a look at this guys this is just truly insane because this is actually the best output i've ever gotten for any sort of twitter output it has working animations it has multiple tweets and this is just impressive to see guys you have multiple animations to different buttons and this was all done with a single prompt and all the code afterwards is something that you can then export off to another file and that's actually the capability of deep sight before we get started i just want to mention that you should definitely go ahead and subscribe to the world of ai newsletter i'm constantly posting different newsletters on a weekly basis so this is where you can easily get up-to-date knowledge about what is happening in the ai space so definitely go ahead and subscribe as this is completely for free now guys, since there's a lot of people using this at the moment, what you can do is configure the different providers. If you keep it on auto provider, they'll automatically select the best provider based off your prompt, which will use different inference providers from fireworks all the way to Novita AI. Now what we're going to do next is create an AI course website and I'm telling it to have functional course progress features and a course plan. So let's see what it ends up developing for us. Now it looks like it has finished developing this AI mastery course website and this is just insane guys. I simply provided one prompt and it generated so many lines of code for me which is just insane. You can see all of these components were fully developed live and you saw the code being generated for it. This is absolutely insane in terms of how it generates front end code and I definitely recommend that you try it out. Now, what you can do even further is add features and iterate on it even further. Now, this is where you can go back into the AI and ask it, could you add a dark mode 
for me please and then it's gonna go and then it's gonna iterate on this previous code for me by adding this feature of adding a dark mode now one thing i will state is that this is ridiculously slow in terms of generating things it takes many minutes to even get your front end designed but obviously it's better than doing it manually but just saying in comparison to many of the other tools that are out there this would take a bit longer but you'll get better quality outputs and there we go we now have a functional light and dark mode that we have added and it looks great now now this is just cool guys because this is where someone had generated this lunar lander uh deep sight simulation and it's kind of insane to see that this was all generated with the deep seek model now the stuff people are creating is just truly insane you can see that it's capable of generating animations as well as functional apps that have displays that wouldn't be generated with other large language models overall i'm truly impressed to see the capability of deep sight that uses the new upgraded DeepSeek model it's something that is completely free hosted off of hugging face spaces and you can easily get started today so i'll leave all these links in the description below make sure you take a look at the gallery which showcases all the different types of apps that have been generated as well as the blog post that gives you more information on the deep seek model but with that thought guys i hope you enjoyed today's video follow me on the newsletter follow me on patreon to join our private discord as well as our twitter page because this is where you can stay up to date with the latest ai news and lastly make sure you guys subscribe turn on the notification bell like this video and please take a look at our previous videos but with that thought guys have an amazing day spread positivity and i'll see you guys fairly shortly peace out fellas